All right, Maria G, I'm looking for you. Maria G, I'm looking for you. Where you been, Maria G? Where you been? I'm looking for you. Maria G, looking for you. Where have you been? Maria G, Maria G, looking for you. Maria G, Maria G, where you been? Hello, everybody. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. It is Friday. It is Friday. Alexa, what's today? Today is Friday, April 15th. April 15th. Wow. What is going on? Where is all the time going? How is everybody? How is everybody? Good morning, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Coffee to you. Good morning. I'm having so much trouble trying to decide about these sneakers. Oh, boy. What pair to keep? What pair to put back? I don't know what to do. How is everybody? Maria G, I'm looking for you. Maria G, I'm looking for you. <clears throat> you having your coffee too? Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Christina, Christina Manu, good morning. Hey, maybe you make a coffee? All right, girl, I'll cut over. Hey, Ayana, how are you? On vacation, eight days straight. Holy smokes! Keep the ones that are most comfortable. Yeah, I keep switching, trying to see which ones are more comfortable. Ah, because everybody says they're going to stretch. All right, baby, <laughs> come on, girl, come on, come on. Maria's here. Maria, Maria, type your question. You had a question. You paid for a question, didn't you? Type your question in the chat, please. Good morning, Olivia, Diana, Lisa, Catherine. Hello, Catherine. Maria, type your question in the chat, please. Oh, my gosh, I'm looking for you. I said it on yesterday, too. I didn't see you. <laughs> Thank you, Payment. You also. No, Angel, Maria, Maria, you paid for a question. That means you got to ask a question. Maria G, you sent in a payment for a question. So you got to ask a question. I'm sorry you didn't feel good. I hope you're feeling better. But I need you to type your question. That's what it was. One question. Uh-huh. You want me to just give a regular general message? Is that what you're saying? You want just a general, a regular message? I'm so glad too, Linda. Right, sister? Very cool, calm, and collective. You don't know what to ask? All right, I'll just give you. I'll just give you a message. I'll give you a message. You got it. You got it, sister. Two seconds. All right. I didn't, forget you. I didn't want you to think you paid and didn't get what you paid for. All right. Let me put you up. Let me put this up here. Make it a little bit higher. Let me get a little bit higher. There. Hello. All right. So I'm waiting for the public service people, the electric people to come. I'm waiting for them so that I can get my air conditioning fixed. Huh. But it was nice and cool last night. Oh, I'm good. 
Good, Olivia, good. Keep it calm. Keep it easy. Don't put no pressure. Just have a lot of fun. Let us see how much fun you really are. Giggle, laugh, compliment them, make them feel good. You'll see. Yeah, now you see me. <laughs> Thanks, Angel. All right. Coming up, Angel. I'm doing your, I'm doing your, I'm right now. I'm doing it. Right now, Angel. Hold on. All right. What's my baby girl got here? What does she have? What message do you want her to know? Give her a warning. Give her guidance. Give her any answers that she's seeking. Please show me. Show me, spirit guides. Please come closer to me. Come, come across the zone, okay? Please come closer to me. All right. There's some unexpected news coming your way, dear. Some unexpected news coming your way, but it is good news. It is good news coming your way, Miss Maria. It's good news coming your way. This could be about money, finances. Could be an outcome for something. Um, yep, you still got it. Messages are coming. Something. Coming. What are you doing? What are you doing? With all that noise? What What are you doing, Miss? What do you keep doing that for? Stop it. All right. All right. Also, you might be looking back on a situation right now that maybe doesn't give you the best vibes. It might be something that you're still trying to move away from. It's something you're, just, you're still working hard on, on right now. You're trying to balance something out as well. All right. It just shows you're trying to balance something out. There may be a decision that you're going to have to make. It might be a hard decision. You might not really want to make it. Or you might not want to complete it or go through with it. But, but stay true to yourself. All right. Don't allow. Don't allow somebody to take advantage of you. Okay. But you're going to have to cut something out. There's something that you're going to be, have to be done with. I don't know what that is. Maybe you do. But there's something coming that you're going to have to be done with. But remember, there's good news coming. Some type of message is coming. It has to do with money. Maybe you're getting a deposit today. Maybe money's coming into your hand today. Maybe a debt is being resolved. Something. And that's your message. That's your message. I'll give you a couple. I'm not sure if I like these ones. These shoes feel a little bit tight. All right, honey. That's your message. Yeah, money is always good. I'll take it. Hey, Joel. Uh, I'm not sure about these shoes. I'm just I'm not sure. I don't know. Uh, I hope I don't know if they're going to stretch or not. I got to return one of them. Yeah, I got to because I'm going to be on my feet for a lot, a long, a long time, and a lot of walking. I don't know if I want the, the, the looser ones, or these ones might feel too tight. Oh, good. Keep painting. That's okay, Lindsay. You can paint. We got Leo here. You can paint. I'm good, Jewel. How about you? All right. You have to break your shoes in first. I know I'm trying. I, I went, I walked, I walked with the nine and a halves when I took Button out this morning, and they felt pretty good on. They felt pretty good on. But if they got bigger, I don't know if they'd feel good. Then I got these nines on right now. I changed them. And I don't know how these feel. I think these kind of hurt my feet. I think these kind of hurt. So I think I think I like the nine and a half better. I think I like them a little bit loose. These just feel they're gonna I don't know. You know it's funny, these feel like they, the nines feel like they fit better. But the nine and a half are more comfortable. Stretch them with big socks. Oh, wide works. Yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, okay, Kayla. 
nine and a half yet, I think. Yeah, I think you're right. Because these, these feel just kind of tight already. So I feel tight already. And I work eight hours on my feet. It's just not going to be good. I can take them off. Yeah, they hurt my feet. Besides this. And these are the nines. So I'm going to keep the nines. Oh, no, I'm going to put back the nines. That's what I'm going to do. Put back the nines. All right, guys, give me two seconds. Give me two seconds. Move buttons. Move, honey. Move. Two seconds, you guys. I don't want to miss the UPS. Okay. Bye. Okay. Alright, these are the nine and a half. If I keep the right ones, they say nine and a half. And these say My feet hurt. They hurt right now. Ugh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> okay, yeah, send it to me and I'll show everybody. up the wall legs up the wall for swollen feet yeah they're they're not too bad right now because it's just the start of the day i haven't done too much i just walk with buttons to go to the bathroom Whew, this is crazy okay i'm on now <laughs> jesus i better keep losing that'll help my feet too keep on losing keep on going all right. All right, I got them back on now. They feel pretty good. They feel pretty good. Can you see? They feel pretty good. And, and I come on my toes. And my toes, my toe comes right here. My toe is right here. Did you see it? My toe comes right here. Alan, I got my children's book in bookstores here. That's yeah. That's great. It's going to storm today. Oh boy. Yeah, these are pretty good, right, BB? Yeah, they they feel they feel really good. They feel really good, and my toe is right here. Here's my toe, right there to the almost to the top. Beautiful, Catherine. Uh, okay, thank you, Lindsay. 
Hey, Emperor. Happy Friday. Linda, I'm so glad. Are you going to send me an autographed copy? Yeah, I will. Yeah, I'm sending the other ones back. And I surprised my daughter. I'm going to send her a pair. So by the time she gets home, she'll have new sneakers. Yeah, that'll be good, Kayla. Okay, Lindsay, I will. Oh, yes, I will. Thank you, Linda. Hi, Kim B. How you doing? Kim B, that video of your part is the funniest video I ever saw. I mean, we know he dances, right, and sings, has a good time, but he loved that TV. He loved that TV show. Yeah, it might be a good idea, LM. Spring break's the worst time to be traveling. I'll be waiting, Catherine. I'm so glad. I think you, you are overdue for all those changes. Three-year anniversary this weekend. An Easter Sun ball game. Very nice, Adri. Very nice. Amen. It's in bilingual in Spanish and English. I love that. Yeah, great. Yeah, I hope I meet my Spanish man. Bibi's going to introduce me to him. All right, folks. Yeah, El it's it's going to come, but right now, man, the interest rates are crazy, right? <laughs> I hope not. Right, Bibi? Maybe I could send you a pair, too. It would tell me what size you wear. We'll all have the same sneaker. Yes, yeah, Skipper Joe. Yes, thank you, LM. Thank you. I love that guy. Let's say a prayer for Skipper Joe. Let's definitely say a prayer for Skipper Joe for his results today. Yes. Oh, boy, I found it. Whew. <clears throat> thank God I found it. I couldn't find it. I'm here. That was just me messing up. We're praying for Skipper Joe. Praying for Skipper Joe. It just, just, I was, I couldn't find my way back. I wanted to text Skipper Joe to let him know that we're praying for him right now. He's going to have a wonderful outcome and be just fine. We're all praying for him. Yes. Is, is Skipper Joe on here? Is he here? Is Skipper Joe on here? You lit a candle? Yes. Oh, great, BB. Don't forget to add Skipper Joe in it. Good job, BB. I saw Mandy posted a picture, so I guess she got different privileges now. That's great. Oh, he's driving. Okay. He's probably on his way. Okay. Oh, you're driving home. You're going to be just fine. Okay, Skipper Joe. Okay. Uh, don't text. Don't text no more, please. Or you won't have to worry about that scan. So don't text while you're driving now. You just go ahead home. Go ahead home. Take your time. Take your time. Everything's going to be okay. Everything's going to be okay. Yes, M. Gordon, hope you're doing well. Lizelle, we're praying for you too. Hope you're doing well. All right, let me get started with today's messages. <laughs> LM.
You're doing great. Awesome. Oh, that's nice, Kim. Hope she's doing well. Oh, to PA. That'd be nice, Ellen. We're at in PA. Today is a beautiful day. Uh, no, Linda, I'm not Zooming tonight. I I've already Zoomed for the month of April now a couple times, so not Zooming tonight. Only be Zooming... Oh, my chest. Only be Zooming once a month. Maybe a couple extras here and there, but once a month. Wow, look at my hair. Already getting regrowth. That's how much my hair grew since I, since I put the highlights in. It's about a half an inch. Jesus. All right. Oh, nice, Ellen. That ought to be really nice. Uh, LM, safe or unsafe? Safe. Safe. You'll be safe. Elaine said, Elaine Cahill said, Skipper Joe, may God bless you with good news. Thank you, Elaine. It's sunny and warm. It's 70 here and it's cool and breezy. It feels so good. Yesterday was so hot. I'm waiting for my public service man, so I better get going because he should be here any minute. Okay. All right. Let me do, I'm going to do elements. I'm going to do elements. I was going to do each sign, but I don't think I have time. Well, I could try. I'm going to try. I'm going to try to do each sign because I said each sign. All right. Weekend energy. Each sign. Starting to sign the Aries. All right, Aries, somebody's giving you a gift. Somebody's coming towards you. Somebody's wanting to be nice to you. Somebody's wanting to go out of their way for you. So it's going to be a great weekend. Things are going to go as planned for Aries. Leo, Leo, you might have felt like you were left out in the cold in the situation. Or you might feel like you're you're trying to get reacclimated to something. There's also an adjustment period here. It also feels like for Leos, you know, go to church. It's like you're going to church or go to church. You, you need to... Uh, surrender the rest. You need to surrender the rest. Whatever that means for you, Leo. Leo, don't be afraid to pray and ask your angels for help because they're there and they're wanting to help, but you have to ask them. Sagittarius, nine of swords, meaning you're up in your head about something. It's keeping you awake. You're worrying for nothing. You can't change anything with worry. So whatever's going on, Sagis, please stop worrying because something needs to change, but you can't change it. The universe will make things fall into place where they need to be. So, Sag, stop worrying. Trust. Have your faith. Trust. Cancer. Page of Swords. You're willing to give something another try. You're getting an opportunity or a chance is coming for you to try again or make it better or do it better the next time. It's coming. Pisces. Seven of Swords. Pisces. Don't bring your baggage into the new relationship. Stop comparing past to present. You're going to sabotage something. Be careful what you're doing. All right? If you're getting ready to meet somebody new, if you're hoping to meet somebody new, don't bring past shit to the present. All right? Scorpio. Seven of Wands. Scorpio. It's like I know what I want. I just don't know how to get to it. This is exactly where I want it to be, or that's exactly who I want to be with, but I don't know how to get to it. I don't know how to make that happen. I have a couple obstacles in my way, is what they're saying, Scorpio. I have some obstacles in my way, but I'm going to work through this. It's going to take some time. This could this could take let's take a couple months. It could take a couple months to get exactly where you want to be. It could take a couple months. Hang in there. Something's about to change, Scorpio. All right, Capricorn. Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, money's coming in or you're bringing money or you got to pay money. So something's happened with money. Either you're going to get money or you're going to have to pay out money today over this weekend. Something may cost you money. Maybe you're going away. Maybe you're going to an event, whatever. You might be spending money. So it's saying be careful of your money over this weekend. Taurus, two of wands. You have to make a choice or a decision. Taurus, you need to make a choice or a decision based on... The facts that you already have, based on the information that's right in front of you, based on simply, it's a, it's a cut and dry. Something's going to be very obvious to you this weekend. It'll be cut and dry. It won't be, well, let me think. 
And you ain't going to have to. It's cut and dry. Okay? You're going to be able to make a decision very easily. Okay? All right. That was Taurus, right? Am I on Tar? Am I on Virgo now? Virgo. You have the Emperor card. Virgo. Am I on Virgo now? You have the Emperor card, Virgo. That talks about standing strong. Being very adamant. Making sure things are taken care of. It's like, okay, we're going to do this, we're going to do this, and we're going to do this. We're going to keep everything um, above water, so to speak. We're going to do what's expected. It's like, hey, listen, it's Friday night. We're going to take it easy. Maybe dinner's going to be easy. Uh, maybe we're going to order a movie or watch a movie. We're all going to sit down. We're going to eat some popcorn or whatever, and we're just going to we're going to chill out. It's like we're not we're not going to be crazy today. Nope, nope. We're going to just take it easy. So whatever this is about for you, Virgo, you're going to take it easy. Hold on one second, you guys. Don't go nowhere. I'm back. Okay, sorry, sorry. So my technician is coming. So Libra, Libra. Whatever you put in is what you're going to get out. Whatever you put in is what you're going to get out. So this weekend can go in the way that you want it to go if you put the work in. Okay? Libra. All right. Gemini. I mean, um, yeah, Gemini. Gemini, be careful of being tempted to make the wrong choice or decision. Be very patient with yourself. Okay? Be very patient with yourself, Gemini. Don't sway the wrong way. Don't take the easy road. Or it's going to land you in the wrong place. All right? Aquarius, you have the fool card. Taking unnecessary risks, so be careful. Don't do it. If you don't feel like you should go, don't go. If you don't feel like you should buy something, don't buy it. Trust your gut. Trust your intuition. All right? Card for the room. Card for the room. Feeling a little bit overwhelmed with whatever's going on. Feeling like it might be a little too much on your plate. A little too much to handle. Maybe your appointments. Maybe there's just... So much to do in so much little time, in such little time, so much to do in, in little time. But I want you to realize that, you know what, if you break it down, little by little, before you know it, you'll have the whole thing taken care of. So whatever's on your agenda, whatever you're trying to fit into your schedule, whatever you're trying to get the right time frames for, know that this is going to work out in your favor. And, and you're going to be so happy that you were able to complete something. For some of you, it's about cleaning out drawers, getting getting rid of clutter, getting rid of a whole bunch of shit that you don't need anymore. So if that's you and that's what you're trying to do, get it done this weekend. It's going to be it's going to be a really big relief for you. Really big relief. And if you're not doing anything, come on over to my house. I need help to clean out this place. I need help to clean it out. I really do. I've had enough of it. I'm, I'm going to start throwing shit out today. As a matter of fact, I'm going to get started. As soon as this technician is done, he should be here any minute they just called. Um, as soon as he gets here and he's done, I'm going to literally start throwing shit out today. So we're going to see. You too, BB. I'm, I'm telling you, I got to do it. You can come over. BB, I ain't joking. I need to get, I want to get rid of shit. I just want to get rid of shit and clutter. I can't take it no more. I really do. I'm not kidding. I'll come pick you up today. I'm not kidding. I will come pick you up. I'll find my way to Philly. I don't care. My girlfriend's home. She knows how to get to Philly. I'll come and get you. Not joking. I really want to throw some shit out. You have laundry to do? Okay. Yeah, I got so much to do. Yeah, Catherine. Yep. You know what? Look at what you don't use anymore. If you haven't used it in months and even a year or worn it, in months or a year, get rid of it. Just get rid of it. Look at your shoes. I got shoes I got to throw away. I got 20 freaking pairs of shoes in that closet. And some of them are, are ruined from outside. I keep one pair for walking the dog in the rain. And I keep one pair for the winter time. And then I have this pair of sneakers for work. That's it. Haven't had a call in AM hours. Oh, my gosh. I'm not kidding, BB. I can, I can get my neighbor to take a ride with me to Philly to come and get you. I ain't joking. I am not joking. Hey, Jamie, your new subscriber. Hello. You're the same way throwing shit out. Good job. Because I'll tell you what. Number one, it's it's bad. It's bad energy. Number two, check out Feng Shui. You got to have free flowing energy. Number three, I got so much shit here. Listen, I'm 56 years old and I got a lot of shit that I've saved. I wanted to save a lot of stuff for my mother. That's not going to bring my mother back. 
And if my mother was here, she'd be saying, throw it out. It, that's old. Get rid of it. So I'm just going to do what I got to do. All right, you guys, I got to go. I saw public service right out front. I got to leave. I'll be back later on. Um, I'll be doing mini reads later. Um, minis are 8888. If you're interested, sign up for a mini 8888. And uh, I'll be back on in a couple hours. But right now, I got to put the dog away. That's the rule for public service. All right. See you guys soon. All right, Linda, make sure you send me an email.